President Trump's bold agenda to make health care more affordable, tackling the recent trend of skyrocketing prescription drug prices. Here's what he said to a joint con uh, session of Congress earlier this week. We should implement legal reforms that protect patients and doctors from unnecessary costs that drive up the price of insurance and work to bring down the artificially high price of drugs and bring them down immediately. This comes after a number of pharmaceutical companies have come under fire for steep increases in prices of really life-saving medications. Joining me right now to talk more about it is the former CEO of Pfizer, Hank McKinnell is with us, as well as the CEO of Vuray, Chris Aranis. Good to see you both. Thank you so much for joining us, gentlemen. Good morning, Maria. So much to talk about. My favorite part of the healthcare story is innovation, and you've got a great innovative product that I want to get to uh, in a moment. But, Hank, let's first talk about this issue of rising drug prices. You were the CEO of Pfizer. How does the pharmaceutical industry feel about what President Trump is saying uh, and, and efforts to stabilize the price of drugs? Well, we certainly understand that there's concern about the high price of medicines. Uh, the facts are, however, that if you take the top 10 selling drugs from 10 years ago. Today they are 80% cheaper because the patents have expired and there's generic products available. Uh, pharmaceuticals have been 10% of total health care costs for 50 years. If you made all pharmaceutical part products free, two years later you'd be back exactly where you were uh, before you took that action. So the issue really should be the cost of health care, not the cost of medicine. So how do you do that? How do you get health care expenses down? Look, I recognize that you really need to have private investors in health care in order to see the innovation process prosper. People need to believe that they can make money uh, in, in, in putting money toward innovations and not see the government control pricing. But the question remains, how do you get the price lower? Well, that's the question we should be discussing. Uh, Sixty-four percent of all health care costs in America are consumed by ten percent of the population. We need to better manage that ten percent. We need to ensure better medical outcomes for ten percent of the population, and that's what new technology, such as ViewRay's new innovation, actually does. Yeah, we're going to.